Hey everyone, in this video I'll show you how to master your songs, but before I start I want to say that I'm not that good uh, into mastering my songs, but I will show you the very basics and what I usually do on my songs, so I'm not responsible if <laughs> I'm being, uh, you know, not that good you wanted. And, well, I recommend you do the mastering um, when you are finished with the song and you have all the sounds going on and stuff. Um, mastering is all about getting the sound um, clean and powerful and uh, you don't want it to be that loud for example or that low uh, it doesn't have to be quiet to be good but um, making it quiet is the is the, um, the trick to make it uh, sound cleaner uh, basically we want to make um, all the sounds um, uh, able to you know listen to um, of course the drums should be louder the louder the loudest part and after that the bass line then the melodies and the most quiet part is the pads um, violins in this uh, particular song so um, the kick should be powerful um, not that much the clap the hats should, should not be that loud, they should be uh, more quiet and this song is completely, la completely unmastered so uh, I'll show you how to master it uh, in the first hand it sounds good okay it just threw in the kick um, I think the kick sounds very um, quiet so I will add some Maximus uh, with the default preset and uh, you know um, increase that so it will go on over here on the zero decibel um, the kick sounds very good now uh, Okay, now it's perfect. Um, this will um, increase the bass a little. You know the low frequencies, the mid frequencies, and the high frequencies. You can play around with that. And on the master track, you need to increase it so it will go um, over here, over to zero. Zero is here on the on the middle. You don't want it to go more than uh, you know one or two decibels well one or two decibels is okay but not that much so that's what to do to make it uh, more powerful and now the kick sounds very good but uh, we have to stabilize the, the other instruments too that's uh, why you should make the kick go down to here you can see the decibels over here so it's about four minus um, the master track is all the tracks together be sure that the master track doesn't go over zero and in case it goes over that be sure to add uh, well always add a limiter over here I prefer Maximus or Fruit Limiter uh, with the default preset always Maximus because it will make it very loud okay now this will limit it on uh, zero decibel and that's what we want now for instance if we had the kick uh, very loud all the other instruments could go more quiet because of the kick that's why I reduced it a little and now as you can see uh, you can barely hear the bass line which is over here and uh, the square lead is very loud that's why we have to lower it a little and it's also so dry let's add some reverb on it then add some uh, maximus or fruit limiter You can still hear the lead, so it doesn't affect the song much. And you can also listen to the bass line. 
which now is louder. <clears throat> Let's EQ the bass line a bit. Okay, um, I want it to be even more dry. And increase the high frequencies a little. And decrease the overall volume because it's gone too loud from the EQ. Okay, I think it's good over here. Now the kick sounds good, the lead sounds good, and the bass line sounds um, okay. Now let's go to the hi hats. As you can see, the hi hats are uh, should be a little more quiet. Maybe add some compressor to it. You don't need to add limiters because they don't go over some specific uh, value of decibels. So reduce it. Reduce it that much so you will be able to hear it, but uh, it shouldn't be very loud. It should be quiet and listenable. The club needs some reverb. Um, not much, but it needs a little. The reverb has that dry, which is the volume, so you can master it from here if you want. Okay. <coughs> now let's see the snares. The snares are really loud too. Uh, let's compress it down a little. You can uh, use compressors, you can use maximus, you can use fret limiter. It's up to you what you want to choose. Um, compressor doesn't limit the sounds and and that's why I don't recommend it that much, but uh, in this case it's okay. And the crash is um, a sound with uh, much high frequencies, that's why we will uh, reduce it a little. As you can see over here, let's reduce it and let's see how it sounds like. And of course, uh, the overall volume should be more quiet on the grass because you can also hear it. Okay, I think it's perfect over here. I think this sound is okay without even mastering. It's on the perfect volume. It just needs some EQ, I think. As you can see, that's what mastering is about. It's about limiting the volume um, to zero decibels on the master track while everything is listenable and clean and enjoyable. You should be able to, to hear all the sounds and you should not uh, hide some sounds. You should uh, listen uh, to the pads even, which is a sound uh, even lower and stuff like that. By the way, I need to decrease them a little. Well, mastering is fun, you know. You can play with it uh, for hours. And the kick could also be more bass. Okay, that's all. I'm done with it. Let's see the time. I think 10 minutes is okay for a mastering tutorial.
Okay, that's all guys. Um, I think this tutorial will uh, show you the basics of mastering. Um, as I said in the beginning, I'm not that good in mastering, but I did my best to help you out and that's what I do basically on my songs. Um, if you want to give more power on the bass, that's up to you. Uh, but I recommend you giving more power to the kicks, you know, uh, those sounds that have high frequencies like the like the hi-hat, like the crass and, you know, all the lead sometimes is very high on the frequencies. Be sure to um, put the volume much lower than the others. Um, the bass should always be, for example, higher than uh, the others. And, yeah, that's what I had to tell you about mastering. Thanks for watching. If you want, subscribe me and thank you. Be sure to check out my music channel which is DJ Theof and this is SPE Theof here. So, bye!